in this lesson we will cover is blank or error so we'll first put a button and then we'll put a label label error 1 <clears throat> button we can leave as is on the click of the button or the text for here we can put is blank or null 2 divided by 1 sorry is blank or error <laughs> now 2 divided by 1 is not a blank neither it is throwing an error so let's run in this so it's false we don't need to click the button for this so it's already in the text now this will return true because 2 divided by 0 is error. We don't need the button. We are directly showing the showing the value output in the label. Now it is blank. Now again it will return true. So this will return true if there is a blank or if it's an error. then we will put two label I will make this copy of this one paste we will remove this from here we will remove this from here on button click <coughs> if is blank or error one divided by one comma update context will assign a variable error in step 1 if there is error we will update context this else we will update context so in in here we have is blank or error if there is an error or blank then we say error in step else we say uh, no error in step one so we run this actually we need to put this uh, text in this here uh, plus there is some error in the formula is blank or error 1 divided by 1 update context error 1 error in step 1 semicolon update context no error in step 1 oh one bracket is missing then no error in step 1 
now we will create one more uh, step here we will call this uh, two by two we'll put a two by two here error two error in step two error two no error in step two and um, let's run this so uh, then we also need to uh, error two okay so both the steps have no error now let's try to produce error in step one error in step one but this is fine so it is still executing step two it is still executing step two now we make zero here and this we make it fine no error in step one error step two and finally we make it zero so it will be error in both the steps then we make a blank in step one and we left it will produce error because it is blank now no error in step two now we introduce we make it blank for two so this is error and step one is no error and then finally if we don't if we don't leave both blank it will give no error in either step so this is the function is blank or error i will put the code in the comments